The neighbor upgraded his house to a giant mansion, and today, I'm gonna get lost in it. This is a terrible idea. Hello everybody, I am Kindly Kian and welcome back to Hello Neighbor. Today, we are checking out a new mod, and it's an elaborate one. Check this out. As I look up, I gaze into the sky, <laughs> the neighbor's house just keeps going. Oh my goodness. That is a very large house. I'd go as far to say, that I'd call that a mansion. The neighbor has undergone a, a slight renovation here at his house and uh, now lives in an enormous mansion. So, so we need to explore this thing. You can see when I look up, the game starts to slow down. There is so much going on here, the game can't even handle it. So the name of this mod is 13 Floors Remastered. I don't remember the original 13 floors, but this is the remastered version. This is by John Drew 24, and it looks pretty intense. So we've got this to-do list right here. Find out what's in your neighbor's house and his basement. Enter the house as quietly as possible through the low security window. Okay, so he has a low security window somewhere on the first floor. Also, why in the world would this guy need a basement with a 13 floor house. Or maybe the basement is part of the 13 floors and he just really wanted 13 floors. Not 14, not 12, but 13. All right, well, with that all said, uh, we, we need to get inside of his house. So where's the low security window? But what, that looks pretty low security, but he's in it. So it's not so low security because the neighbor is literally in the window that I need to get into. All right, well, while he's being a big bully on the other side of the street, I'm just gonna go into my house and see what's going on in here. Wow, whoa, this is cool. This feels like a little cabin. It is so cozy. We got like dungeon doors underneath my my stairs. It's kind of kind of creepy, actually. This is a pretty sweet house, I gotta say. Why, why bother exploring the neighbor's giant mansion when I got this sweet pad here? I'm going upstairs. Ooh, I've got an attic up here. It's snowing in my attic. W why? This is interesting. I like this. We can, we can kind of spy on the neighbor from over here. It always comes down to this, but who is the real creep? I mean, I'm the guy with binoculars and like a sitting station in front of a window that is directly facing my neighbor's house. I feel like I'm kind of the weirdo here. What? He's got a boat hanging from the bottom of like floor number 11 or nine. I don't know. There's a lot of floors, okay? But that is a boat that is very high up from the ground as you can see. Ugh, this is weird. All right, well, let's give it another shot. Ooh. Oh, I can't interact with these keys. Okay, so they, they don't do anything. I'm gonna go around this way. Let's let's try jumping around over here. And then maybe we can we can sneak in through that way. Oh, he's got a he's got a grave back here. It's sad. <gasps> is that you UFO? There's an UFO in the neighborhood. What is happening? Does this have any connection to the neighbor or is it just you know? Just another day where, you know, there's a UFO sighting in our neighborhood. This is very weird. Oh, hi, you're right there. What is going on with this water? It's like blue goo. I don't know if I want to touch that. <laughs> what if it's from the aliens? The neighbor's staring at the aliens too. He's, I mean, understandably, he's kind of freaked out by the UFO too, I, I would think, unless he's part of them. You're a weird dude. Can I get in here? I'm inside. We've made it inside of the mansion. Now it's time to explore the mansion, but I am like pretty overwhelmed here. There, I mean, 13 floors <laughs> and we're on floor one. We got a lot of work to do. Oh, found a key in the very first drawer that uh, I started exploring. So that's, that's a good start, I would say. Let's just keep exploring some of these drawers though. What about here? Oh, I can't open those. Okay, what about this one? Nada. All right, so we have a brown key. Oh, I can unlock the front door. 
That seems like a smart idea. Okay, so now we have easy access to the front of the house. Need a red-ish key. Okay, this is a weird room. Why are there a bunch of eyeball paintings around the golden apple? What does that mean? Are any of these like a button or something? Okay, none of the eyeball paintings were buttons. So that's good to know. There's like a, a bell. Is that the school bell? It's like a clock tower or something? What time is it? How many bells do we hear? That's three. I counted 11 bell rings. So it's 11 a.m.? I guess that sort of makes sense. The sun is still kind of rising. Anyways, enough concern about the time. There's a coffin <laughs> in this room. <laughs> you know. Oh, oh, you can hide in it. That's pretty cool. Also pretty creepy. Okay, so we've got Bob the Builder hanging out up here. He's he's not really doing anything. Um, oh, this this seems to be the basement. This is the door that we need to open. But first, we need to get through 13 floors of weirdness and chaos. Okay, um, got it. Well, let's head up to floor number two. See what's going on up here. I got a generator. Turn that guy on. I don't know what that's gonna do. Also, crow painting. You seem weird. Hmm, can I, oh, I can't pick up those plants. I can't pick up anything in this room, I'm realizing. Very strange, I can't, I can't grab the paintings? I, I don't know what's going on with that room. We'll just move along, for now. Can we go in here? We can. Hello, Mr. Mannequin, and hello, doll. What is this? Can I break this? <sighs> yeah, okay, okay, uh, ooh, do I have this key? I think I do. These are weirdly painted bricks. They're painted the same color as the wall. Interesting. Uh, is this... Okay, okay. I like this. I don't know what's happening here. Oh, a golden wrench. Okay, I'm gonna grab that. What we got going on in here? Anything? Nothing? This is kind of a strange room. Not gonna lie. So I think all I got out of this room is this wrench. Which is totally fine. It's a good start. Let's carry on. Okay, we've made it out to a balcony. Oh, this is... This is the room that we, we started in on this second floor. Okay. It's all sort of making sense. Also, this? What does this mean? Exit? What? I don't understand what this means. So, the, the key for the lock on the exit, which is right below us, right? It's a little bit different than the other keys, is that right? Like, it looks a little bit different. You can tell it kind of has like a heart shape at the top of it. And the key section's a little bit different. It's not like two teeth, it's more like three. I, I don't know. <laughs> this is, this is interesting. Let's continue exploring the second floor. But we also need to put this wrench to good use. Um, why is there just, oh. Is that a, is there a doll in, in there? There, there seems to be, oh, I just, I just teleported. Well, I hate that. I feel like these bookshelves have to be something going on. Wait, is there a day night cycle here? It just got darker. I don't know. I'm not going to worry too much about it. Let's, uh, let's avoid stepping in his bear traps. Oh, no, he's here. He's here. He's alive. He's awake and he's going to chase us. Shoot. I've escaped. I'm gonna jump out of that second balcony. Let's see where this wrench goes. Also, what do you think we can? Nope, no power. Okay, never mind. Oh, I think that we need to use the wrench right there. You can see the bolt. Okay, at least we know where to use it. We just don't know how to get there. Also, this blue goo, I'm gonna touch it. Okay, I don't, it didn't do anything. Good, unless I'm now infected and the UFO is going to take me away. Okay, so we definitely got a lot more exploring to do. Wait, there's a red? Oh, it just goes in there, okay. Um, oh, bathroom. Is there anything in here? I don't think there's anything in here. Gotta check the toilet and the bathtub, of course. There is a cord running through the bathroom, so I guess you wanna track that down. Oh, we found the kitchen. Wait a second, one of these paintings, maybe? Maybe something weird is going on with one of these paintings? Hello? Paintings? No? I can't interact with these paintings. I can't interact with any of this stuff. Again, it's very strange. It's a lovely kitchen that you have here, neighbor. But is there actually anything in here that is useful to me? Another room with nothing really in it. F 
for, for me to use. So I guess we'll just move along. Oh dear! Oh my! Hel hello. Oh gosh. Okay, so he had like five cameras in that room. That was super neat. Okay, he's outside. So, this is our chance. Except that there's like a billion cameras over there. And I hate it. I'm just gonna go for it. He's gonna see me, but I'm just gonna run. And then he'll not know where I am. It kind of sort of seems to have worked. So there. Here's the weird chair with the doll in it that teleported me earlier. I don't think I'm gonna mess around with it. I feel like there's definitely more that I need to figure out on the bottom floor, but I'm not seeing it. Also, what? Why is this? This is locked down now. How did that happen? I don't think I need to go back in there, but why is it locked? It's very weird. Let's head back down and um, can we go in here? Can we? Break that? Okay, we can. Nope! That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. We're, we're leaving now. Okay, goodbye. I'm just gonna casually walk in through his front door while he's chasing me. I don't know where he is right now. Oh, he's right there. <laughs> he's right there. Okay. This is not going great. You are just not gonna make this easy on me, are you, neighbor? Of course not. Why would I expect any less? Well, I'll tell you what, guys. We got a lot more work to do here. In the neighbor's mansion. A lot more exploring, a lot more to see. But for now, I think I'm gonna regroup, take some time, we'll come back to it later. So guys, that's gonna do it for this episode. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo in it right below this window. You can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.